Coming up on Daily Planet, we're going to show you an amazing technology that lets badminton players train all by them. And that is <laughs> coming up right after the break. If you've ever tried to practice your tennis moves by yourself, you'd know it's pretty difficult without another player on the other end of the court. Well, that's also the case when it comes to badminton. But Jay discovered a way around that problem. One of the problems for elite athletes is they have to train a lot, hours and hours and hours. Not only is that a huge time commitment, but you have to have other people there to train with you. Well, that problem has been solved by something called the Knight Trainer for badminton players. Alan Sklar is with Knight, Black Knight Sales. Hi, Alan. Hi, Jay. And uh, he's going to demonstrate this machine, but first tell me, what does it do? Well, I guess the simplest way to tell you what it does is to let it do it. The Knight Trainer has been built to fire badminton shuttlecocks and to, <laughs> sorry about that, uh, to simulate every shot uh, that uh, badminton... Every shot? Every shot. There's only one shot that a badminton player cannot practice with the Knight Trainer, and that's his own serve. So give me a couple of examples. We can set it up to hit clears, smashes, drives, drop shots, very delicate net shots. Uh, when we set it up for smashes, if the player wants intensive reflex training, they can come 2.5 times per second. Wow. The part of the shuttlecock we call the cage is very fragile, whether yeah. it's made of nylon or feathers. That cannot be subject to any pressure coming in. So the feeding mechanism only grabs the cork only feeds the cork and sends the shuttlecock out at anything from a dribble, which we just saw, to a blast that will challenge the best player. Have you found that badminton players really take to it and the feel that it does duplicate playing with another person? You can't exactly duplicate another person has variable elements that they can throw into it. It actually adds a different dimension to training. It gives them a tireless uh, training partner who never becomes bored, will feed you what you never need. Never gets irritated. Never gets irritated. <laughs> will feed you what you need over and over again. And whether you're a beginner just trying to enjoy the sport more quickly through learning the fundamentals, or whether you're an advanced player who wants to play a certain shot and make that shuttlecock roll over the tape every time to win the point, uh, or return every smash with pinpoint accuracy, this is the tireless training partner. But it won't replace a coach. It won't replace sparring partners. You still, because the game itself is based on human interaction. Right now, I wonder what, what prompted uh, this technology for badminton rather than other sports. Is there something about badminton that lends itself to this? I think it's more the other way around. It's that this has existed for other sports. We have pitching machines for baseball. Right. Right. We have little ball launchers for table tennis and, and, of course, tennis machines, ball machines, and so forth. Badminton, given that it's all, one of the most popular sports in the world, has lagged behind tremendously in not having something like this. We developed it in Quebec. We're manufacturing it in Montreal, and it's leaving Canada to go around the world. Alan Sklar is with Black Knight Sales. This is the Knight Trainer, and you can learn more about it if you go to our website, discoverychannel.ca.